Alright, teach me the ways of chaos. You have converted the Satan guardsmen. Yeah, that's right, I'm a badass. What else did you expect? Shut down their facilities and came here for guidance. I propose to them a mission in their home of Satan, the realm of order. They have already embarked on the quest. I thank you for your assistance. So he, he said you would show me the he way sent chaos, he, he sent all four twins to I create chaos in the realm of order. You should know better than to bind a man of chaos to his word. <laughs> I will free myself of this oppression. Fight. 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 All right, man. You wanted it. I'm going to show you real chaos right now. Whoa, that fighting stance. Oh, okay. So he's going to actually teach me. Cool. We're going to learn how to play with Havoc. Man, this character definitely needs to return to a new Mortal Kombat game. I think he will for sure. I think uh, too many people were asking for him. To not be included in uh, the next Mortal Kombat well game. Done. Out of all the 3D era characters, I think he's the one that I would want to see the most. Well, that up. That up too. Classic down too, of course. His fighting stance is called Snake, which is appropriate for him. Oh my god, that stand one has no range. That's like the definition of T-Rex arms. <laughs> That's so funny. Even in uh, old Netherrealm games, characters had T-Rex arms. That's crazy. <laughs> I have to be right there in the corner to make sure that my, my first attack doesn't miss. Look at that. <laughs> What the fuck? I'm literally touching knees with him, and this thing misses sometimes. Maybe it depends on, like, uh, the stance that I'm at. How do I, like, have him switch back to... I don't know. I just know that it missed a couple of times, and that's unreliable. Oh, shit. So his offense relies on his... His offense relies on his 1-1 one, one combo string, and the first attack misses from point-blank range sometimes. Tang Su Do? Tang Su Do. <laughs> this looks like an elegant stance. Oh, yes. I'm dancing like a gentleman. Look at that. Ballroom dancing, bitches. It looks like he's doing some sort of formal dance, doesn't it? Nobody wants to dance with him. That's why he's uh, he turned to chaos because he has this stance from <laughs> his dance lessons that he took, and no girl wanted to dance with him. Oh damn! That is a powerful down two. Definitely have to... Must have some, some cool launchers, right? So far, he hasn't had one launch, launching combo. But that's what we're learning. Hopefully, the uh, stance switch combos allows me to launch people. See, this is a better uh, stance because it doesn't have T-Rex arms. I like these longer combos. Yeah, 16% for 5 hits. Alright, time for his weapon. What does he have? Ooh, a fucking club. A club with spikes at the end. <laughs> Finger jabs. <laughs> Man, I... I you learn quickly. These characters have so many moves. I feel bad for... Ne well, actually, maybe they have fun with it, but... They have, Netherrealm has to come up with so many names for these moves. Toe Bash, you know, Shin Swipe. They have to come up with names for every single one of these moves. That's crazy. And there's so many characters. Imagine it for Armageddon. I don't, I don't even know what the uh, moves list is in Armageddon, but I'm sure everything is named differently. Oh, there you go. Stand 3 is a launcher. Stand. 
stay in. That is painful. Imagine getting down two with that. God damn. All right, two, 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 ten percent. That's it. All right. Oh, here we go. Ah, oh, nice. Nice. I'm definitely going to use that one. It's very easy, too. Stand three, back two, 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 two. Good shit. All right, stand switch time. Okay, nice. Wow, that did 23%. That did more damage than the other combo. What was it? Uh, one, one, two, stand switch, right? Okay. I'm going to use that. Fuck that. 21%. See, the other one did more. Oh, damn. 16%, but it's a launcher. And then I could do from that... Maybe I could do... Uh, I know I could do back two. Hold on. Let me see. No, what was it? Oh, it's this one. Oh, nice! Ah, uh, but I can't launch him again. Okay, that's fine. Wait, what was it? <laughs> Which one were we doing? What the hell? Fucking spin move! God damn! Did you see how he twists his body? Ugh, that's gross. He has a low slide. What a nasty ass character. Oh, god damn. I didn't remember that. What the fuck, man? Another realm. You could put him on his knees. Why did you have to make him bend his knees backwards? Lord Boone, you have some explaining to do. Oh, you learn quickly. that hurts. Ugh. That hurts me just looking at it. Plus, they added the crackling sound, too. Oh, God, what the hell is this character? I don't remember. Oh, what the fuck? I don't remember any of this. Never mind. Don't bring Havoc back in MK12. What the fuck is... Imagine how nasty it would sound in MK12. God damn, that's disgusting. What the hell, man? Dude, stop hitting me. I'm just trying to learn here. What is that? Is It must be a power-up, right? I assume it's some sort of power-up. The fucking sounds that it makes, too. Corpse taunt. I wonder what kind of power-ups. Oh my god. How the hell was that? That wasn't even the move that I was supposed to do. God damn, Havoc. Honestly, I swear to you guys, I don't remember any of the moves that he that he has, so this caught me by surprise. That shit is nasty. Round one. Fight! Shit. There you go. 19% damage. This does more fucking damage. Look at that. I could just do that all day. Instead of doing, uh, you know, the other launcher. I mean, it looks cooler, but I'm trying to go for damage here. God damn, knees bent backwards. Ugh cracks his own head i mean i crack my neck you know when i have yeah. a little kink back God. there but well done you tried to kill me <laughs> oh, what a me? fucking <laughs> what what a, a little sequence of dialogue right there oh, i think i understand well I done from the unpredictable you try to kill me not from a structured tutorial i did not realize you had no intentions of harming you when you attacked and therefore, I learned to adapt to what I perceive to be a real threat. Yeah, right. Correct. Yeah, Except right. He's I just saving face because he lost. Chance. I was quite serious. Because you have survived my assault, however, I give you this key to an ancient labyrinth. 
May it unleash chaos upon your journey. <laughs> Portal key. You already know that, you know, he was serious about beating my ass. He was just saving face. He was like, no, you know, it was all part of your training. I was actually trying to kill you, but since you beat my ass, I got to tell you it was part of training. All right, off we go to our next mission. Whoa, what the hell? Oh, there you go. Is that acid? Dude, why are you standing in there? You have 10 seconds before it melts the bottom half of your legs. Or is that piss? Somebody... That is where everyone... That's the vomitorium. As Shijiko walked through the shallow pool, he felt a strange, dizzying sensation. As if the world was passing him by. So, going into the pool actually made him older. Oh, that's how they do, like, his time skip of age. You have found the Chaos Kamidoru. Yes, I found it in a labyrinth not far from here. But I feel strange. I feel like I have changed. Indeed, you have. Many years have passed since you first entered this realm. I suspect the labyrinth you encountered contains some time-altering agent. Time has passed, but you have not perceived it. Many years? By the gods. I do feel older. It must have been that strange liquid I stepped through. That, is a that was nothing but Tremblone, my friend. Look how jacked you look. Are you kidding me? That was no mere liquid. That was all trend. He sucked all that up, and that's why he looks so jacked. Alright, I didn't even pay attention to what he said. I was admiring Shijinku's amazing, completely natural transformation. Uh, how many more realms do we have to go? Like three of them? What now? Who's gonna interrupt me now? All right, we got three to go. What realm is this that we're going to? Oh, the order realm. Because that's where these guys are trying to create chaos. Welcome to Outworld. Oh, Outworld. Cool. This is Outworld? I have heard many stories about this realm. This is the domain of the Emperor Shao Kahn. Hell yeah, I want his autograph. He is a thief, a deceiver. He is not the rightful lord of this realm. There was a time when he was much like Raiden is to your earth advisor, but he abandoned his position and stole Outworld for himself. Who ruled Outworld before Shao Kahn? A powerful military commander, Onaga, the Dragon King. Ah, why are you so defensive when we're talking about Outworld, Under bitch? Shao Kahn's rule, however, Outworld has become a dangerous and chaotic place. Be wary as you continue with your quest. I will keep my eyes open, Damashi. It's pretty funny that uh, Shijinku does not question anything the flame says. Nothing. Not even the fact that he is so defensive with, uh, with Outworld, you know? Maybe because his master or the person, the creature they're trying to summon was the leader of Outworld before. Ooh, Melina. Look at what we have here. Yeah, I know I'm good Another looking. Straggler for Melina to sink her teeth into. Lady, I stop talking in third person. Trouble, but I will defend myself if necessary. I must warn you that I am quite skilled in the art of combat. Is that so? We will see how long you can endure my attacks. I will sharpen my teeth with your bones. You know, with that veil like around your face, you actually look very beautiful, but keep it on if we go on a date, okay? Please. Because I took a peek of what you look like under there. Oh, we're going to learn Melina. This is definitely one of Melina's best costumes, man. Maybe the, the Flesh Pit is probably number one, you know? For a pervert like myself, I think the Flesh Pit is the number one costume. But I think this might be number two. This costume is amazing. And it covers her beautiful teeth. Excellent work. Come <laughs> on. 
these are tutorials at, at least. Ooh. Wait, what was it? Wow, that's cool. So stand three on her uh, first very old. Oh, that's another launcher too. Shoulder pain. The hell was I saying? Oh yeah, these uh, tutorials could get a little tedious when they're just showing you like the normal attacks. What the hell? This is literally the same combo string that Havoc has. Where it misses from up close. Look at that. I'm literally, we're literally comparing high heels to each other and it misses. It's the same combo string. I guess, you know, there's a lot of characters. There's only so much they could work with, so they give some of the characters the same combo strings. Ooh, I like that one. 13%, but it's a launcher. So I gotta turn the air on, man. It's a nice fucking air. It's not because I'm playing Melina either. It's because my computer's literally, literally next to me and it heats up the room. Well done. Well done. That sweep. What the hell? <laughs> button didn't come out damn she has a lot of launchers compared to havoc that's for sure I wonder how much... oh that's the other stance that's what I was about to say because I was well, doing stand three because that's the launcher in her other stance I wonder how much that into a down two does I bet you it does like a nice chunky 18% or something keep it simple Talk to the fist. Talk to the hand, lady. Ooh, look at that. How much does that do? Let's see. 18%, not bad. Oh, God, I gotta sneeze. <coughs> what the fuck is that combo string? Is it because she's at, at the wall? Oh, okay, yeah, it's because she was at the wall. I think mid-screen, that'll work every time, right? Because it missed for some reason. And that did 18% by itself. Excellent. Of course, you have to have Melina in her size. Well done. Show me some combos. Yeah, Melina has a lot of launcher. That's good. Damn. Right to the neck. You ain't gonna be speaking no more. Maybe that's a good thing. Damn, that did 17%. One, one, one. Not bad. that do damn 18% wow cool Ho hopefully she has some cool uh, stand switch combos she has a lot of launchers whoops oops 14% see I think switching stances actually nerf some combos How much does that do? That did 18% by itself. Whoa! 27%! I'm definitely doing that combo string. Oh my god, do the fucking ball roll. I'm sure you could combo. I wonder if you could combo the uh, stand 4 3. Hold on, let me see. Oh, you can't combo after after her borrow in this. Too much recovery, I think. Cause I tried to do stand four and it didn't come out. Has her tele kick, of course. Yeah, classic Molina moves. Always gotta have the the uh, the traditional. Oh God, 
with my uh, little veil. Actually, both of them. I could see her teeth. Ugh. She should get something that's a little less see-through. <laughs> yeah, you can't combo her ball roll in this game. I like that uh that sound. Fantastic. Yeah, I had a good time too, Melina. Alright, let's see. What was it it was this? It wasn't that one, right? 32%? What the fuck? Damn. Hell yeah. You bet your ass I'm gonna keep doing that combo. 32% for a simple stand for three stand switch. She is on the ground and not moving. Run away. Ooh, Shao Kahn? What the hell? I didn't even know he appeared in this game. Impressive. You survived my assault. You are a great warrior. There is much we can gain from one as skilled as you. I thank you for your kind words, Melina. Perhaps you would be interested in assisting our cause. Recently, the walled city of Lei Chen has defied the rule of the Emperor Shao Kahn. He has sent us, his Tarkatan forces, to take the head of the Overlord there. She's claiming Tarkatan? We would Tarkatan? Like to complete our objective without incident, but we will use force if So in necessary. this game, she claims Tarkatan. Would you act as our voice and convince this fool of an Overlord to surrender his life to Shao Kahn so that his subjects will be spared? What if the Overlord refuses to surrender? Everyone in the city will be slain. The city walls are strong, but they will not hinder our assault for long. This is a most uncomfortable position for me. But if it means the citizens will be spared, I will see what I can do. You have our word. Bring us the head of the Overlord and we will spare them all. Damn, I gotta decapitate him? Shit, man. I don't like this. What's going on? It's Super here, and thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did and you aren't subscribed already, make sure you guys do so. And if you want to see some more, there's videos popping up on the screen right now. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.